the world's biggest passenger jet is making a comeback. But how? And why? And how much money are we talking about here? He wants Airbus to build a next-gen, a 380, an A380. This new version could have redesigned wings, a smaller tail to reduce drag, a carbon fiber structure, and maybe even folding wing tips for tighter airports. And under the hood, the Rolls-Royce Ultrafan, which could cut fuel use by 25%. Well, you're gonna wanna hear this. In 2021, Airbus gave up on the A380. Most airlines quietly retired their fleets. But Emirates, they had other plans, while others walked away. Emirates held on tight. Today, they've got over 100 A380s. And if you love planes as much as we do, hit that subscribe button and fly with us. And Emirates president Sir Tim Clark has a radical idea. If it works, the A380 Neo could take on modern twin jets while flying hundreds more passengers. Airbus has already scrapped most of the A380's parts. It's a tall order, but Tim Clark isn't backing down. His message to Airbus, if you build them, we'll buy them. And let's not forget what passengers love about the A380. The space, the luxury, the bar up in the sky. No other jet can offer that. Of course, there are hurdles. Restarting production would cost up to $20 billion. So what do you think? Can the A380 make a comeback? Let us know in the comments below.